Hello, this is Choo Choo Photo Pod. No, <laughs> this is Choo Choo, and today we're going to talk about how I set up my event rotator widget. And that's up here at the top of the screen. You'll see it with the last sub and uh, my name and various events that have happened in my channel. And we're going to, so I'm going to show you how to set that up. <coughs> so, um, let me turn off the title there we go sign into your stream elements and like I said my noise lands on the page I have to go to the most but you set yours up the way you want as always I always sit down and we're gonna go into the themes gallery well, first of all I'm gonna show you my overlays I have the various ones that I have set up and here is my event rotator and I didn't even name it. I just said make me one. And it called it Event Rotator Last Event. So we're going to make sure we don't name the new one that. That's why I came here. So it is located in the Themes Gallery. So we're going to go there. Under Widgets. And here it is. Events Rotator. So... Themes Gallery, Widgets, Event Rotator, and we're going to create one. And we want to create a new one. You can copy these onto some. If you have uh, one set up and you want to put it up in the corner, you can do that. That's what Copy to Existing is for. But we're going to create a new one. And we are going to name this uh, Initials, Event Rotator. And we'll call it number one. And we're going to tell it create my widget. <coughs> and we're going to go see my themes and overlays. So we are back over here at the overlay page. And we are going to slide down. There it is. This is the events rotator, and here's the ER1 that we created. We're going to edit that. Blinding white page. Now it comes up here, and I'm going to leave it there for the, for the editing purposes. And you know mine is up there working. See it up here. That's where I have it located on the page. I put it up here, and then it shows up when you install it, where up in the corner. So um, it's already picked up the uh, stuff from my. Uh, stream elements and put it in here for me so uh, um, what we're going to do is we are going to slide down here but well, we're going to click on it that's the easiest way to get to where I want to go and it says settings here we're going to go to the settings you can have it pause if you prefer but I like it on never stop okay and I didn't change any of these settings for left, right, righteous, any of this stuff. I did change one of the colors. Okay. But we are going to, let's just start at the top and work our way down. Yeah, I did change this color to red because the very title is white. And I did not like it so I'm gonna go ahead and change it again this is how I did it I open this up and I just see how it was blue already I control C that and then I hit cancel and then I came here and I hit control V and I hit select and then I had the same number and that was uh, that's the only one I'm gonna change if you want to change any of these colors you can punch the color you want you can Control C V it all the way down. It's the same color everywhere. Your choice. Okay, on a new event. Reset the slider. I left it at yes. Okay, so that immediately if somebody followed, it would show. Okay. Slider number one. The title. If you just want don't want to show, that was the white. If you don't want to show that, then you would say no, don't show it. You can pick yes or no. 
But I picked yes, and I changed it to say choo choo. It's my channel. And I have a message I say at the end of all my streams, I put it right up there. Remember, you are loved. And it will come up here. So then we're going to go down to slide number two. See, there it is already. The latest follower. Yes, I would like to see the latest follower. Okay. Then we're going to come down, and it says number three, show the latest chair. Yes, we would like to see the latest chair. Then it says number four. Would you like to see the latest sub? Yes, I want to see the latest sub. Slide number five. Do you want to see the latest host? I have a very big problem with showing off host. Yes, that is also the raider. Will come up there too. Because they come in at the same time. With the raid and host. Number six. Yes, show my goals this month. No, I don't have it. I don't know how to set the goals up. And no, I don't have a goal for the month. So we're going to tell it no on this one. Okay. You can also change it to something else if you choose. Okay. So, but no. Next slider. Follower goal. Yeah. Put the total number of followers that I have in the channel. That would be awesome. So yes, I left that alone. Slider number eight. Yes, sub goal. Put the total number of subs. That is fine, amount of subs. See, we'll leave that up there. Number nine. Show. It says no already. Some data for total cheer. Um, we could look to see what kind of data is available. All-time donation, all-time donator. If you have those kind of people and you want to give them credit for it, you can do that. Okay, there's a lot of things you can do with this. 10 is blank and 11 is blank and you can uh, figure it out if you don't know how you can go and steal it off of another setup that you like that you saw and copy in the uh, bottom thing but I think sometimes when you pick this these change so anyway play with it get it the way you want it and when you're finished you come over to this button all the way over here and hit save <coughs> Did they just say I had 235 subs? Something's wrong with the way the sub is set up. So let's go back to subs. I do, maybe all time overall I had that many. I think we want subs latest. Let's try that one. Because I don't think I have <laughs> That's nice to know. I have picked that many up over the, over the year or so. Year and a half. But I don't have many right now. <laughs> Hurry up. We're waiting. That's the last sub. The last host. That's the total number of followers. Come on. That's better. Nine subs. That's what I have right now. Yes. Okay. So, um, that is how you set it up. And like I said, you can pick any colors you want. And you can locate this anywhere you want. If you want it down over here, just pick it up and move it over here. Move it anywhere you want it. You want it centered lower put it there save it and that's where it'll be i have mine in the upper left the, the functioning one and to get 
Here is a copy of the overlay URL right here. There's all kinds of places. This is a copy of the URL. I copied it to the clipboard for me. See it pop up down there? Or here, you have a copy. And when you go back out, so if you're setting up several of these and then you want to copy them all over after you open up your OBS, you can do that. And then here, ER1, copy URL. So you have several places you can pick up the URL number. Okay, I hope that that you create something for your channel that's unique to you, something you like, something that's not... Um, I liked it because it was small, out of the way, and not huge and overwhelming on my screen that uh, we, I could play a game and uh, the viewers could enjoy and the view of the game. So anyway, uh, we will sign off here and talk to you another time about another subject.